this is the second NaNoWriMo vlog or vlog or however you meant to say it and it is roughly halfway through the process so it's the 14th of November today hence the the puppy yay my word count is currently 21,575 um, and as of yesterday I was only behind the goal I suppose by 96 words um, which I'll make up easily enough so that's all right I've not done today yet which is why I said as of yesterday so this week has been a bit of a struggle for me um, I've had a really really bad time actually sitting down to write um, I've had a few days where I'll be honest, I was amazed I actually managed to get changed. <laughs> and I really did have to force myself to sit at my desk and actually put words on paper and every single paragraph was like pulling teeth. It was very difficult. And yet I still managed it, so that's nice. I haven't got much else done <laughs> this week outside of this writing. Um, so it is nice to kind of have this as like a, an achievable goal every day, even if I don't meet the daily word count. Um, I'm not too fussed about that because I know then there'll be days where I am writing a bit, I'm enjoying it and I'll write, you know, 2,000, 2,500 to make up for it. But it, it is just useful knowing that as long as I sit down and I write something, even if it's only a paragraph, it's better than having not done that. So it, that's good um of course the longer i put off every day the more difficult it is to then actually do it and the worse one feels and the worse one feels the less one wants to do it and it's just a bit of a a bad cycle but hey ho on the plus side i feel like i'm getting a better idea of the world building and the sort of plot or at least like the, the backstory of the plot i'm trying not to think too far ahead because I don't want to try and think about where I'm going to go and then find that it changes because of a prompt or the characters just decide to do something else. I'm thinking in pencil rather than pen, I suppose, but I've, I'm getting a better idea of the, of the backstory and the stuff that happened before the story takes place. It's difficult to sort of write about the future when you don't actually know what's happened previously. So that's fun. Um, I've also finally gotten around to writing about some fairies, which is exciting because I like fairies, so I'm pleased to finally have those on paper. They are probably the best bits to write. The, the times that I've written more words have been the chapters where there have been fairies. Um, fairies in like proper old English and Irish folklore are being sort of slightly tricksterish, mischievous from the land of fairy, as opposed to like little, little winged people. It's not quite gone where I thought it was going to go. I, I really did think it was going to be both main characters have got both being flawed in their worldviews and having to find the sort of the correct medium in, in between. But that's not quite what happened. One is more obviously wrong than the other but they're not... even the one that's not the most wrong is still not completely right and has to, I suppose, learn on her journey so hmm. that's all I can think of to say. It's actually really useful doing these vlogs because it's a couple of days that I really honestly I don't think I would have written anything if it wasn't for the fact I knew that on Sunday I would have to sit down and be like I didn't write anything on Thursday because I was too depressed. I didn't think that would go well. Um, even if I only wrote like 300 words but it's fine. Um, so actually this is really useful as a accountability tool. I'm hoping actually to have finished 50,000 words before or on the fourth Sunday because obviously the 30th of November the last day will fall on a Tuesday I think um and I I don't really want to have to do a I don't know I think I'd like the fourth Sunday to be like the last one and to be wrapping it up so either I'll finish then or I just instead of a Sunday when I do like a Wednesday one or something but um Hopefully for Sunday because that would be even and that would please me. So yeah, I, f I don't know if I should bother talking about like actually what I'm writing specifically, like the actual world and story, because I don't know if people would be interested in that, but maybe if I run out of things to say next week I'll go into that a bit more. Yeah, that's that for this week. <laughs> Still ploughing on. Hopefully we'll have a better week this coming week. I said week too many times in that sentence, making that sentence week. Hopefully I'll be doing better next Sunday, but I might not be.